Hello all you space engineers out there, Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 33 here on Planet 26. So in the last episode, uh, we finished, almost finished the observation tower. I got just a couple of more things. I need to put some lights in there, and I was trying to think of how I was going to do that. So if we go up there and take a look... Let's get up there. I sure like this elevator. It works really, really good. All right, so we're up and in here. So I can't put lights up on any of the windows, right? So my only other option is to either replace one of those or all of those corners but that'll look kind of goofy I think uh, so what my thought process is I uh, hop up here can I get up here and I take out that window block so let's go ahead and do that am I close enough to it of course not uh, well let me do it this way then let me uh, place a block down here Let's go five and turn that around and oh you know what I got to reset uh, I uh, changed my skin I need to go back to the battered armor which that should be it right there before I get too carried away uh, yeah, that's it. Battered armor. All right. Let's see if we can get up here now and take this window out. All right. That didn't cause anything to crash. Now we're going to put a full block right here. And let's go ahead and build it out. Oh, I'm out of steel? Well, good heavens. Thought I had more on that. All right, well, we'll take care of that. All right. So the idea will be, and I don't think that looks too awful bad, actually. Then I can put lights on each side of these and set the intensity and stuff on that. So let me go down and get some steel and get the materials for lights and we'll see if we can't get those in place and then I think that's just about going to take care of the observation tower itself all right let's see let's grab uh, let's grab a hundred of those uh, let's grab a hundred of those and then let's do this do I have lights down on my I think I do. Where are they at? There they are, seven. So I need at least four of them. So if we, one, two, three, four. All right, let's go up and finish the block. And There we go, that's finished. Now, let's see if I can place these blocks. Actually, I think I want them to be red. Uh, actually, yeah, red. I think red will work. Let's change that. Now, let's uh, grab these. Oh, no, that's right. It's not going to... Uh, oh, wait, wait a minute. Oh, I got... Uh, so, that's not going to work either. Because, again, the window blocks are still taking up that one whole space. 
Can I? So we flip these around. And they would go against that. Uh, it's just that it can't attach to a window block. If I was to flip those around, I would need to do that one, that one. Hmm. Uh, I still like the idea of putting it right there. All right, let's uh, let's do this. Let's see what happens. Uh, five. Let's put a. Oh, where to go? One, five. All right. And we do that. Well, let's just take the one window out first. Now, I am going to have to get on top of that. So we've taken that out. I wonder how a, well, I would have the same problem with uh, an armor plate. It has to go up above. But if we look at the light, it will attach to there now. And I wonder if I put that there, and then I'm going to have to get on top of that up above. All right, I tell you what, let me uh, keep working away on this, and I'll get uh, some uh, resolve on it, and then I'll catch back up with you once I kind of figure out what I, exactly how I'm going to do this. Okay, I think I've got this figured out. I built up and I was able to flip uh, those that window over and then uh, I'll show you here in a bit, but I should be able to now uh, place the light on this one wall. Uh, get back over to where my lights are, seven, yeah, I can place that light there. I haven't, uh, oh, I did. Let's, uh, turn that. I didn't, well, I can grind it out, though. So let's go ahead and do, do this. I should be able to grind this window out. All right. And then I should be able to place the light right there. All right, so now it's just a matter of building those out. 
Uh, let me see if I can reach them. Uh, let's come up here, see if I can... There we go, let's build that out. Let's build that out. We can reach that. And let's see, can we get up here? And then we can build that out. Alright, so the lights are all in. So I should be able to... Let's get these out of the way. Well, hold on. Before we get too carried away, let's do this. There we go. Let's adjust those lights. So, that's interior light four. All right, three. Yeah, okay. Three, four, five, and six. All right, so let's select all of them. We're gonna go down to my yellow light. And we're gonna load from profile. And then we need to bring this radius down I'm not sure what will be good. Maybe somewhere around seven. And then let's bring the intensity down on this as well. And I think that should do pretty well for lighting up here. Turn that off. And then I can always adjust that a little bit later. And can I reach that from here? Yeah. So I can take this out. Alright, I just got to go back up and build, finish building the uh, uh, windows out that I took out. Alright, let me go do that. Okay, as you can see, I've got these all in, and what I did was I just plopped down a uh, window on top of that block, but I didn't finish it. I just kind of left it so it kind of looks like a, a frame. So now we can do this. Let's uh, see if I can get down. Okay, I've got to take all these blocks down, so once I uh, get these done, I'll uh, catch back up with you. Okay, I've got those blocks all out, and uh, I think what I want to do is let's uh, let's bring those lights out just a little bit more. So if we go and grab all of these, and we actually. Let's uh, make this maybe nine, but we bring that intensity down even more. So let's bring the intensity down to maybe 1.5. Let's try that intensity down just a little bit more and actually bring that length out you 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 and you let's bring this out to 10 and let's bring this down to 1 
Okay, so you're in the dark here. You're sitting. You're sitting in the chair. You got your console and everything right here. You can see all of that. Uh, you can see out uh, because it's uh, you know not too bright. Let's go look at another one. Let's go sit in. Let's go sit in this one chair here. So you can kind of look out that way. See everything back off over there. You can still look at your control panel. Uh, and so, yeah, I think... Yeah, I think I'm pretty good. I actually, I think this observation tower is actually complete. Uh, we got the lighting, uh, and you can get in and out with the elevator. And let's take a look at it from outside. This area here is the next area I gotta work on, but there's that. Let's uh, just go up. The re reason this scaffolding is here is just so that I could. Uh, get a better look at the observation tower from above and I like that you can see the control panels here in the dark looking over there yeah I'm pretty happy with that so I'm gonna call the observation tower complete okay so the next thing I need to do is I need to this is going to be a landing strip because that's an observation control tower and then uh, I'm going to make an operation center down below that'll have some other additional uh, uh, monitors and stuff like that in it being able to check inventory and stuff like that but this has to be a what I need to do, and I think what I need to do is bring bring this platform out and square this up. Uh, I need to put a connector in on top of that large container that I have right below here. So I think that's what I'm going to work on next. So I've got to figure out exactly where that is. Maybe I go down below and then uh, grind out up above so I know exactly where it's at. And I think that's what I'll do. So I'm going to uh, let me get uh, started. Uh, I'll start getting this some laid out and then uh, I'll catch back up with you uh, once I get a little farther along.
Okay, well, you can see I have uh, added the extension on the roof, and I have managed to uh, get the uh, supports up there for it. So there shouldn't, so that should look pretty good. And I'm not going to need to worry about lighting in underneath that, because that's just going to be open down there, just like it always has been. But as you can see, uh, I've got the supports built all the way down uh, to the edge there, and then they run all the way up. You can't kind of see it in the dark. Once it gets light out, you'll be able to see it much better. And, uh, you know, I might put some, you know, a light here and there just to kind of shine out here. Uh, that might make some sense, but we'll see when I get, get to that point. But yeah, that's uh, getting the getting that extension out. So if we go up above, we can see it from up there. Floor two is what we want. I did get the uh, block cut out of here so you can kind of see that's where that large container is down below uh, finished manufactured products which then the ships will come in and pick up out of that spot there to take up to the asteroid uh, transfer station and then from there whatever the the corporate home company wants to do then they can grab it from there but you can kind of see now I'm going to put railings up all around the edge here so you're not going to walk off the edge because if you kind of look out it gets to be kind of a long ways down especially if you're out over there so let me get started uh, building this out and uh, yeah once I get this kind of built out then I'll uh, catch back up with you Okay, well, I think I've kind of got the supports in. I kind of like the looks of that. It looks like it's supported well. Uh, if we go up above, and I got that all done, at least on the floor itself. So let's go over here and get to our elevator. Go up to number two. And 
you can see that the floor is all in up here. Now I've got to put the railings in and I think that's what I'll do next is put the railings in. So once I get them all up and in, uh, yeah, I'll uh, catch back up with you at that point. So we are making progress on this. Okay, I've got the railing up and around, so you're not going to step off the edge, which is always kind of a thrill or, uh, you know, always a concern when you're walking around up here and if you're not paying attention. So I guess the next steps are to start laying out the platform and certainly just one of these is not going to be enough so what I might have to do is if we go down below and take a look down there I have room that I can run some uh, conveyors and so I might put in a couple of more ports and they would uh, all come out of this one large cargo ship, uh, cargo container right here. So there's going to be enough supplies in there, uh, especially after we go out and grind some more down. So this thing will be full. So there should be plenty of supplies for them to pick up and haul up to the base uh, that we set up on an asteroid up there. So, the, so I think, uh, and looking at the time, we are already starting to, uh, I've been building for a bit here on this. Uh, so let me see if I can get a little bit more done. Let's go up and take a look. And let's just kind of see what I want to do up here. So we'll have a port right here and maybe if we run them out maybe another port right here and if we come down I don't know maybe six ports we'll set up six ports to kind of spread out amongst here so that would look pretty good and then I want to paint and lay some uh, lights down and stuff like that so that we have basically kind of a landing strip up here. So I think that's what I want to do up here. Uh, I got to do some thinking about that. So the problem, problem when you start painting is it paints it all the way down through to the bottom. So uh, I'm not sure how I want to lay that out. Uh, I actually, I might have some decals. Let's take a look here. Uh, I think, let's see if we go into the decorative blocks. Uh, warfare. Symbols. 
Marks of the future. And it may be over in the textures, but again, if I do it on the textures, so if we go over to our textures, yeah, I guess what I'm thinking of is the hazard armor, and then that's going to end up painting it, which we will put some hazard armor around. So let's, if we select this, and we go over here just as a so if we paint this like right oh I know what I gotta do uh, that's my welder if we go here and change this to Hazard. Alright. So if we do that, do that, do that, do that, do that, do that. Then that will be, you know, we'll have the hazards kind of marked out. And maybe by the time I get all six of them in, it'll look pretty good. And I see the sun's coming up, so uh, I think I think this is going to be pretty good. So we finished. So I didn't. I don't know if I got as much done today as I probably wanted to, but we've got the lights in up at the observation tower as it's completely finished now, and then we've got the uh, landing strip all somewhat uh, laid out. Uh, we just need to, and then the railings up so that it's safe up here. So I just need to start putting in uh, maybe like a little, you know, a little corner maintenance. Uh, we're going to have uh, cargo blocks and stuff like that set up around here uh, just to really kind of make it look like a landing strip. All right. Well, I think with that, uh, we're going to call it good. If you all like this uh, video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps the video out a lot. And please subscribe. That really helps the channel. Uh, and ring that bell. It will uh, let you know when I'm uploading new videos uh, here on the channel. All right, all you space engineers out there. Keep your heads low. Keep building away and don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.